Something really shocking has just come out about the mysterious interstellar object 3I Atlas. Scientists recently found something so unusual that it made them take a much closer look, especially as it's moving toward its closest approach to Earth and Jupiter. New data reveals that the surface of 3I Atlas is nothing like the surface of a normal comet or asteroid that we've seen before. We were able to infer the composition of, uh, of, of the surface of this object using an infrared hmm. uh, uh, spectrograph. So the, there might be something else propelling it. According to a new study posted on October 31st, 2025, and reported in news articles on November 3rd, 2025, Scientists discovered that 3I Atlas has a deep outer crust, somewhere between 50 and 65 feet thick. And here's the twist. The outer crust is completely different from what's inside the object. That means the outside and the inside don't match. The chemical composition of that outer layer hasn't been changed by normal space weathering or heating. So, scientists are asking, how did this crust form? Was it created naturally, or could something strange, maybe even artificial, have happened to it? To understand what's going on, a few researchers have published new papers suggesting that 3I Atlas has been traveling through our galaxy for billions of years. It's a huge object, weighing roughly 33 billion tons. And during its long journey through interstellar space, it would have been bombarded by cosmic radiation for an incredibly long time. Because of that, the original icy materials, like carbon monoxide, may have slowly transformed into more stable or less volatile substances, like carbon dioxide. That could explain why the surface and interior look so different. The irradiated outer shell no longer resembles the pristine material from its home star system. The findings indicate that the gases ejected as it approached the sun originated from this altered outer layer. But here's where things get even more interesting. Some scientists are putting forward radical ideas. They believe that 3I Atlas is not a natural object, and its altered surface is strong evidence of this. By the way, why do they think that? Well, it's because the outer surface seems to have a chemical composition that fits with the idea of an industrial coating, something we'd normally associate with technology, not nature. The fact that the outer layer is so different from the core material adds weight to that idea. Scientists have previously detected signs that nickel and cyanide are being released from the object. These elements could be the result of a chemical process involving a compound called nickel tetracarbonyl, a substance that's usually produced in industrial environments on Earth. In short, this discovery has opened up two huge possibilities. Either 3I Atlas's surface has been altered by natural cosmic processes over billions of years, or maybe something unusual, perhaps even unnatural, has happened to this object. And here's where things get even more surprising. Scientists are now saying that this altered surface of 3I Atlas has started to show unexpected behavior as it passed very close to the sun recently. New data coming in from several observatories around the world showed that 3I Atlas began to glow much brighter than expected when it reached its perihelion. Normally, a comet brightens gradually as sunlight heats up its icy surface. But this one did something very unusual. Instead of following the predicted pattern, the brightness of 3I Atlas suddenly shot up to around magnitude 9, which is far brighter than what scientists had calculated earlier. This sudden surge wasn't part of any expected model. Here's a shocking coincidence. Right after 3I Atlas made its closest approach to the sun, scientists recorded a powerful solar flare on November 3rd. In fact, they confirmed that it was the strongest solar flare observed since July of this year. The most exciting discovery about 3I Atlas is that scientists have now found clear signs it's not moving exactly as gravity predicts. In simple terms, besides the pull of the sun's gravity, something else seems to be giving it a tiny but measurable push. 
This effect is known as non-gravitational acceleration, and it has caught the attention of astronomers around the world. Uh, it discovered is a deviation by four arc seconds in right ascension from the expected path, and that's very significant, statistically significant. Uh, I calculated, given the level of acceleration that they inferred, that was reported uh, on the Jet Propulsion Lab uh, website for 3i Atlas, uh, is uh, that corresponds to uh, a, evaporation of about a sixth of the mass of the object to give it that kind of a boost. Uh, the extra push is extremely small, yet it's still large enough to matter in precise orbital calculations. Scientists say the exact cause of this non-gravitational acceleration is still not fully understood. The most likely explanation is outgassing, a process where the sun's heat causes ices trapped inside a comet to vaporize and release gas. These escaping gases act like tiny thrusters, giving the object a small push in the opposite direction. When we look at the 3 i Atlas after it goes out of uh, hiding behind the sun, uh, and that should happen within a week or two, uh, if it's a natural comet, we should really see a very bright, massive cloud of gas, uh, and perhaps even a cometary tail that is extremely bright uh, around it. If we don't see that, the question is what propelled it? Well, in addition to all this, scientists have noticed something else very strange. 3i Atlas appears bluer in coronagraph images. This means that the light coming from the object contains more blue wavelengths and less red light than normal sunlight. In simple terms, its color balance is shifted toward blue, which suggests that 3i Atlas seems to be emitting its own light possibly from gases being released as it gets closer to the sun. Scientists say they've never seen this kind of behavior before, not even in comets that come from the far reaches of the Oort cloud. According to Professor Avi Loeb, NASA actually has some of the clearest images of 3i Atlas, captured by the high-rise camera aboard the Mars orbiter. Yet, so far those detailed images haven't been made public. This has raised a big question. Is NASA hiding something about 3i Atlas? Or is it simply a matter of waiting for the official data analysis to be completed before they release their findings? Whatever the reason, the lack of response from NASA is only adding more mystery to an already puzzling object. Adding to the mystery, before 2017, we had never detected a single interstellar object. But within less than a decade, we have now spotted three, Oumuamua, 2i Borisov, and now 3i Atlas. Is this just a coincidence, or have such visitors always passed through and only now we have the technology sensitive enough to detect them? Recently, Professor Avi Loeb divided all the unusual observations about 3i Atlas into two main categories. In the first category, he listed the anomalies that might be explained with more data in the future. These include things like its size, the strange anti-tail, a forward jet of scattered sunlight that's about 10 times longer than it is wide and points toward the sun, its unusual chemical composition, and its strong negative polarization of light. In the second category, he placed the anomalies that may remain puzzling forever. These include the fact that the trajectory of 3i Atlas is aligned with the ecliptic plane, the same flat plane where all the planets orbit the Sun, within just 5 degrees. Another strange detail is that the arrival time of, of this interstellar object seems to have been perfectly timed to pass close to Mars, Venus, and Jupiter. Even more mysteriously, the direction from which the object arrived is aligned within 9 degrees of the famous WOW signal, detected on August 15, 1977 which some scientists once thought might have been a message from an extraterrestrial source. Professor Loeb has argued that those who strongly insist 3i Atlas is just an ordinary, naturally formed comet should be held accountable to explain all these unusual coincidences through purely natural processes. After passing Jupiter, 3i Atlas will continue outward away from the Sun, following a hyperbolic path that will carry it toward the outer edges of our solar system. That's all for today. 
Don't forget to check out our new 3i Atlas Interstellar Object t-shirt. If you like it, buy one to support the channel. Have a great day and thanks for watching.